do you use remote access software? If not, what do you do when you're out somewhere and decide you need a file from your home computer? You could carry it around on a CD or a flash drive or a memory stick somehow. Um, nothing wrong with that. Or you could use free remote access software such as TeamViewer or the one that's built into Windows, which never works. Um, or you could go this route and use LogMeIn. LogMeIn is free and it's entirely web based. All you do is install a small file onto your uh, target PC, whichever one you're going to access, and it just sits there. It doesn't use a whole lot of resources either. Um, and you can have it always on so when you want to remote access it it's completely web based from the computer you want to access on. I do not have it installed on this one that you're seeing me use now. now I'll go over a few of the features of log me in with you. I'll go into my computers and it will show me all the computers I have installed. My Acer laptop, the other laptop and the server which two of them are offline. It tells me if they're offline. So I can click on the Acer laptop and it'll say connecting it asks me to log in with my Windows username and password, so I'll do that. And then it shows me all the different options here of things I can do. I can remote control it, I can put it the file manager, um, so I can transfer files, mini media, I can have uh, people temporarily view or control the PC. Uh, sharing, I can easily share files, uh, even the ones that are too large for email. I can change all the preferences and there's always the help page if I don't know what I'm doing. I'll show you the remote control first. So now you see my Windows XP desktop, and I am controlling this computer as if I was in front of it. I can go to Start, I can go to Control Panel, um, I can bring up Internet Browsers, whatever I want to do, and I can control this as if I was sitting right in front of it, which I actually am, but for the purpose of this demonstration, I'm not. I can, anything I can do in front of that computer, I can do right here in this web-based interface. So I'll go ahead and get out of the remote control and see how that works. There's also um, remote sound, which is really nice. So if I'm controlling that computer from somewhere else, I'm going to listen to music I have on it or watch a movie I have on it. I'll hear the sound from that computer on the computer I'm using to control it. I can go into the file manager as well. And now I can transfer files from that computer to mine or from my computer to that computer. So if I need a PowerPoint presentation or a document or something, um, I can do that. I can just easily transfer it real quick or the other way around, transfer things over to that one. I can also bring up the mini meeting and have people view or control the PC. I can set up uh, file sharing in between the PCs, even if they're on different networks. So if they're not plugged into the same router or something like that, I can share the files easily through uh, LogMeIn as well. I can change any preferences I want to, remote control, security, network, log, reboot, and advanced. Uh, as you can see, I'm using LogMeIn Pro, but they also have a free version that's very nice. I'll take you through some of the versions that they have. Go products. LogMeIn Rescue is for IT help desk. It's great. I've used it. Absolutely love it. Uh, Rescue Plus Mobile is good. IT Reach is for IT professionals. Uh, easily manage and control a computer on the server or the web or the web without hassle of on-site installations. LogMeIn Pro is what I have. Um, free is very good. I mean, it runs on Mac or PC. Um, LogMeIn Free is as good, if not better, as TeamViewer. Like I said, I recommend the Pro. Uh, and there's some other ones here as well. We'll go over some of the features of LogMeIn Pro. Remote sound, drag and drop, sharing, remote printing, which is a nice direct connect, mini meeting, file transfer, file sync, Drive mapping and quick clips, all very nice features. You also get a free 30-day trial of LogMeIn Free when you or LogMeIn Pro when you sign up. LogMeIn Free, um, sorry, LogMeIn Pro. You do not get remote sound. Uh, you can access PCs and Macs. Um, free fast remote access. Access your home PC from the office, 100% free to use. Like I said, you don't get the file transfer or um, remote printing or any of those features with LogMeIn free, but still great program. Um, like I said, you get the 30 days for free when you go and sign up at LogMeIn.com. Get 30 days of pro, no credit card required, and then you just automatically get downgraded to LogMeIn free if you don't want to keep it and you just want to use free.
Um, so there's uh, there's other options out there. Of course, this is my personal favorite and the one that I've used for quite a while. And uh, I was recently upgraded to Pro, courtesy of Logman. They gave me a free one-year subscription, which is very nice of them. And uh, I love the Pro better than the free. I gotta say, it's definitely worth the price. Uh, you're welcome to go on there and check out pricing. It's very affordable. Uh, remember to come by the live stream where we're typically talking hardware, software, Mac, Linux, uh, PC, Windows, websites, anything and everything tech, electronic related. And we're streaming live with the live video and audio feed 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at live.techgurushow.com. See you later.